Let's now shift our attention to what is happening in Nepal, where Nepal's Prime Minister Pushpa Kamal Dahal Prachanda is not ready to give up without a fight, or at least that is what it appears like. He's set to seek a fifth vote of confidence from the House of Representatives on the 12th of July. The Dahal government fell into a minority position after its ruling partner, CPN-UML, agreed to form a new government with the Nepali Congress. The Dahal has decided to face the parliament without stepping down amidst mounting pressure. It is important to note here that the 69-year-old Prachanda has won four votes of confidence in the parliament during his one-and-a-half-year term. The latest round began after the Nepali Congress president, Sher Bahadur Dioba, and the Communist Party of Nepal Unified Marxist-Leninist, CPN-UML, inked a midnight power-sharing deal. The duo wants to form a new national consensus government to replace the Prachanda-led coalition government. 78-year-old Dioba and 72-year-old Oli have also agreed to share the Prime Ministerial position on a rotation basis for the rest of the term of the Parliament. For context, the Nepali Congress is the largest party in the Nepal's House of Representatives. It has 89 seats at the moment, while CPN-UML has 78 seats. The combined strength of the two large parties is 167, which is actually sufficient for a majority of 138 seats in the 275-member House. A correspondent from Nepal, Saloni Murarka, has been tracking the story very closely for us and has sent us this report from Kathmandu. Listen in. Following days of deliberations and political drama that has been unfolding in Kathmandu, Nepal Prime Minister Dahal has decided uh, to go for yet another flow test and not step down from his position. As CPN, UML and Nepali Congress have been persisting Prime Minister Dahal to step down with this decision, Prime Minister Dal has put this matter to rest and uh, on July 12th, he will go for his fifth round of War of Confidence. Well, the CPN UML even issued a statement last evening urging PM Dal to abstain from taking any major decisions that might have long-term impacts in Nepal politics. Well, this statement has come after Prime Minister Dal was making an attempt to thwart this new coalition and also keep KP Sharma Oli from taking over. Well, now for this upcoming uh, July 12th uh, flow test, it is very unlikely uh, as of today for Prime Minister Dahal to win this vote of confidence as many other small French parties have extended their support to CPN, UML and Nepali Congress. Saloni Murarka for Vion, World is One in Kathmandu, Nepal. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.